Hi and welcome again to 5 minute Revit. Uh, today we continue with graphic display hierarchy in Revit. Uh, last 5 minute video we uh, we, uh, we have uh, we have uh, we have talked about uh, visibility graphic override host layer and today we will talk about phasing graphic override. That's mean the Ford hierarchy in a rivet uh, that's the for the display hierarchy in rivet that's mean if we have already before applied the visibility graphic override host layers or visibility graphic override projects in uncut line or object style and we applied the phasing graphic override he will override the, all the graphics before that's mean if uh, i go here in uh, the sheets I will see this plan view double click here and if I check whatever element in the rivet like wall for example I check wall and this is the property of the wall I go down here and I see phasing phase created new construction phase demolish none what that's mean if uh, let me grab uh, the uh, the door okay here phase created phase demolish phase created new construction phase demolished none that's mean each element in a rivet it's aware about the time that's mean uh, if we, for example uh, i select this uh, this wall here and i come here and I put this wall that it's created in existing and apply. Look what will happen to the wall. I just uh, make escape a couple of times. Here, you see, it became gray. What that mean? That mean he take the graphic override of the phases. And when we go for for uh, to set up this graphic override, if I go to manage here and they go here in this uh, tab phasing and i click on phases here i have this dialog box this dialog box have uh, three types i have three uh, tabs project phase phase filter and graphic override we will start with graphic override if for example here you see when we we have put this wall in the existing, we see that the projection surface have override. The cut uh, column has lines and patterns and it's uh, override already with, uh, with the lines, like with the gray lines. If I click here, I just uh, change the color here and I put it uh, blue, for example. Okay, okay, apply. Look what will happen and here look that's mean he became blue that's mean it take the graphic override of the phases i come back again here and i go to override and this time i go here for the cat column and i change the pattern here click and the pattern i will put for example here um i will put that uh, solid fill black okay apply okay nothing happened now if i go to phases graphic override this time i will go to existing phase and i go here to the pattern and i click on hidden and when i click on hidden like that I will for uh, foreground I will put visible and I put here a fill a solid fill pattern I put okay apply okay and you see what happened we have here the graphic override here for the uh, for the uh, for the phases this is how it's work in uh, phasing in a rivet that you take an element and you assign to a phase. 
next time we will go deeper in the phasing.